first thing in the morning, we got all the gear laid out. How are you feeling? Pretty psyched. Four, six, eight. This is certainly not the way to pack food, but more on that later. Up at 5.30, 60 to 90 minute approach. Neither of us has done. This is Benj. Hello. <laughs> Originally from Montana, right? Yeah. Crushes. Tries. Tries. <laughs> that's all we can really ask, right? Really pay attention to the topo so you don't end up like us. <laughs> we got a Karen. Yeah, that's El Cap. No, that's not. <laughs> that's the brothers. I came to the valley like, I think four years ago with my friend Ben, we were on the Salafay, and one of the chances to see Higher Cathedral, that north face with the lichen, and color wise like the Galveston Canyon in Montana, which is funny. You didn't think you were getting a Montana reference here, did you? Now you've gotten two. Oh, gotta admire the spire. That's what they say. When I first came to Yosemite, I didn't even know what El Cap was. I drove into the valley and got snubbed on Camp 4 camping and hiked the falls trail alone and tried to hire a guide to show me what trad climbing was. Then it cost $300 and I said screw that and went and met some rad people in Camp 4. Oh yeah. Approach done in exactly 60 minutes. Look at this view. And I'm somehow already bleeding. It is. We are committed to pulling the rope and trying to send. Because who the f cares about getting down in the daylight? Nobody. <laughs> the last crusade is a 600 foot 512 multi pitch on higher cathedral rock that is yet to see a second free ascent. Hopefully, he gets to some of this before the sun hits. Pitons keep the spice at bay. Further left? All right, I'm warmed up now. Whew. <laughs> Pulling into that crux move, there's just leaves. First pitch in the books, and we are hauling. Oh yeah, we're hauling. Free climbing tactics. Sun's coming out, so that's fun for the first of a few crux pitches. From here on out, every pitch is either 5'11 plus or 5'12. 
putting them down quickly is certainly of the essence. First decently cruxy pitch in the books. 11D felt fairly graded. Look at these views, man. I can't get over it. Oh my gosh. And then that next ledge is a jog. So what are our options? We got the high easy road. That's at 5.9, but then Rob's Traverse goes at 11 plus right here. No, no, no. That's the 5.9. That's oh, the 11 I'm, plus. I'm turned around. <laughs> Way low. I thought you'd just go for those flakes. Okay. Well, naturally, we have to go the low route. Take the low road. That's yeah. what I say. Yeah. They never say take the high road. We've got the low traverse coming in very low. This feels like L cap climbing. Yeah. It's Down, over, to actually go up. Huh. Okay. I think this is right. Yes! Going lower than you think. You got it, dog. Yeah, there you go. Like a total sloper. Up's a little better, yep. Um, there you go. Next one's a jug. Sick! That was one of the better pitches. One of my favorites for sure. Yeah. So fun. Really good movement. Really unlikely too. Up, down, 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 down. Right, down, 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 right. Okay, now you can go up. Oh wait, fall onto a foothold. Crucial beta. Nice, dude. Come on. That crack up there looks good once you can get up there. And this, folks, is what we call commitment to the send. Unties. And pulls the rope. Sweet. Round two. That would hold. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it holds. <sighs> Holy shit. Okay. Wow, okay. Okay, you take that. Hiding from the sun, because it's hot. Ben's just sent, so now it's my turn. Coming, ah! Me! The sponsor of today's video, Range Bars. Not just for all cap anymore. These six ounce bars pack 700 calories, less weight, 
and less wrappers to deal with. And the best part is that they're organic, mother Click the link, try them for yourself. This is when things get serious. I have not sent this pitch yet, I need to. We're gonna give it everything we got right here. This is it, focus, got our beta. Move slow, trust our feet. Oh my God. <laughs> That's the most I've ever worked and sent something on a multi-pitch. Same. <laughs> oh my God. Dude, solid effort. Holy shit. That was everything. I sent the Crux pitch. <laughs> After giving up twice and giving it probably 10 goes from the start. Oh my gosh. Like. We're learning to tie knots. 600 feet off the ground. Have a bite, you take down low, you cross it once, cross it again, same direction, and fold it down, keeping this crossover, down through the bottom, and then up through this bottom loop. Now folds down, multi-directional, and easy to untie. After two hours of belaying, Benj is back in the lead. Uh, he gave me a solid hour, hour and a half of belaying on that pitch too. <laughs> The climbing was Still incredible. Awesome. Yeah. It just has good features the whole way, right? Like yeah. It's just interesting. And just it's enough. never just like, I'm just pulling on bullshit. Yeah. Well, I felt a little bit like I was pulling on I definitely felt at some point like I was standing on bullshit. Yeah, that's true. Well, look at these rivets right here. Yeah, I know. It's old aid line. Rivet, 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 rivet. Nice, dude. Bye, old friend. It's interesting that that's, that term is called a rope gun when like, oh, oh shit, damn it. Oh, it's okay. All right. That's my bad, sorry. You just put down the fifth pitch. I gotta follow this and then we got one more. And then we nab the second ascent. Second free ascent. All right, Benj, I'm climbing. I'm officially cramping in both arms and my left leg. And switch. 
Big money. When you're very patient belay partner, once iced tea, they get iced tea. I mean, there's only like a fifth of a bottle of it. All right, haul away. I couldn't tell if you said nice dude or iced tea. One of us has thirst on their mind and I wouldn't put it past me. Dude, you just fucking hike that. That was really bad. <laughs> Hell yeah. We just both sent the extendo fifth pitch. And it was sick, and we're really happy to have sent it because we're pretty much out of water <laughs> and the boys are cramping and dehydrated. One more pitch, which is seasonally wet, but the good news is not this season, bitch. I cannot get over the spires, dude. Yeah, I know, this view is... Oh, look at those people up there. Ah, oh, sick. Yeah! They don't care about us, but I'm gonna take a picture anyway. Here, uh, young hero <laughs> embarks on the Wild Apes Traverse. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Wild Apes Traverse pitch. I'm trying to make the, really establish the second free ascent. A line that's been climbed quite a few times for not having a second free ascent. We see a bolt in the distance, but I won't help him here. All right, watch me here. I copied your exact beta. Yeah. <laughs> that was cool. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I almost blew it right there. Oh, oh my god. Oh. I had such a nice jug. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye. That would have sucked ass to do that. Ding ding ding. We did it! Good work, dude. That was sweet. Second ascent. It was a ton of fun. That's a great route. I was thoroughly impressed and thoroughly enjoyed it. Hell yeah. Climbed really well, too. Yeah. Every single pitch was really fun. A little wild with some traversing. A, a lot of difficult traversing, but. A sick climb. Second ascent in the valley. Let's go! Oh, 
Well, that certainly looks like fun. <laughs> We are down on the ground as darkness falls. And we still have to pull rope. Yay. But we're down, and that's yeah, what matters. And we sent!